Hi again. Today we're going to learn how to use a plane to help us create an extrusion cut on a curved surface as shown over here. Let's see how we can able to do this. Okay, now we're going to show you how to go about doing it. I'm going to open up one of my files that I've created previously. Okay, I'm going to call up the file dome with hollow. Okay, as you can see, this is a dome. There's a hollow internal. Right, I'm going to use plane now to create a hole on this curved surface. What I'm going to do now is going to move to origin. I'm going to find out a plane to be used. Okay, you can see all the planes. So in this time, I'm going to use this one, exact plane. I'm going to make it visible first. And then I'm going to choose an axis to help me okay, create a plane at an angle so that I'm able to extrude cut a hole. Right, in this time, I'm going to use the Z axis. I'm going to make it visible. Okay, you can see over here. Right, so what I'm going to do now, I'm going to use a plane. Instead of using offset plane first, I'm going to use angle to plane. I want it to be angled to this plane, about this axis. So I'm going to select this plane, and then I'm going to select this axis. You notice that right now the plane is at 90 degrees. I'm going to change it to 45 degrees. Click enter, and there we go. We have a plane new plane that is at 45 degrees to this flat plane here now the next thing I want to do now is I want to click on plane I want to offset this new plane by a distance say 58 and I click enter and I'm going to create a rectangular extrude cut okay I'm going to select create 2D I'm going to select this new plane the angle plane that I just offset right and I'm going to draw a rectangle and dimension it okay I'm going to set it about 4mm okay that's done I've sketched out the rectangle which I'm going to use to extrude Okay, to extrude cut okay, into this surface, say I give it all and I click enter and you'll notice that the hole or the rectangular slot has been created. So now I can, you can see that there's a lot of planes lying around. So what I can do is I can teach you how to hide it. So I'm going to right click, okay, I'm going to right click, I'm going to click on visibility to off it right click on the plane visibility to off it right click on the plane and visibility to off it and there you go now you have a dome with a slot that is or a rectangular that is cut through the surface of the dome 